just got some mail I uh, ordered the stuff online um, some of it's from Aliexpress some of it's from wish um, let's see I think that's every all the place oh some of it's from um, from eBay um, but I just want to pop on here and show you some of the things that I had gotten in case you're interested uh, the first thing are these little cutters and they're made to put on your washi and I'm pretty excited about these because I like my washi to be cut smoothly. And you know, happen to grab, sorry, happen to grab a um, a pair of scissors every time is kind of annoying. So you can stick these onto your washi, and then it has a little serrated edge right there that just cuts it. I thought that was a pretty cool idea. So I grabbed a couple of those to give those a try. I also got a couple of these kind of stamps. I really like these kind. Uh, this one is airmail. And this one says canceled. I thought those were both really cool. So I grabbed those. Ordered those. I didn't grab them. I ordered them. Here's another little stamp uh, I got for doing different kinds of journaling and just page filler. These all came from a company on um, AliExpress called Mr. Paper. And he has merch so much, so much. I'm going to have to pause this to open it. All right, magic, it's open. These are, again, just kind of things that fill a page, uh, especially in your journal if you just want to stack some stuff. So I thought that one was pretty cool. Um... This one, and they're in different languages, sometimes French, sometimes there's German, sometimes there's this, what does that have? Um, that kind of looks like a postmark, and then here's another one that's kind of a postmark looking one. So I ordered those, I those were cool. Here's the next thing here. I should have got out my uh, tripod for this. These are just a bunch of little different types of papers. And he stacks it full. <laughs> because those are, I mean, it's all I could do to get it open. There's all different kinds of little, little bitty papers. And then there's some little blank papers in there as filler. To kind of actually give you some filler on your pages. Something to cut, tear, whatever you feel like doing with those. Uh, here's another little stamp, and it's pink. Is that not cute? A little pink stamp. Got a little just our cat on it. Thought that was adorable, and even the stamp itself is pink. Too cute. Here's some more of those little papers, and again, it's just stuffed full. But these are all kind of women and Renaissance um, type things, just to give a little color little accent. All right, next item are these little antique vouchers. See, I believe that's German, that spelling of voucher, but uh, everything else is in English, so cool. Here's some little bitty teeny tiny coupons and tickets. When I ordered these, I didn't know they were this tiny, but for the prices that you pay, which is very little, um, it's a good deal. All right, this one is called Paris Black and White. And again, they're just little papers. You can see how little they are almost stamp size, but everything in here is black and white, um, Paris themed. You can see there's, I can get it open a little bit more. 
All right, there we go. And just all different kinds of little black and white. Uh, what are those called? The fronts of books. Um, I can't remember what they're called. They're like the thing that they put in the front of books. Book plate, I guess. Is that right? Maybe. And then just different designs. So those are kind of fun for, again, for your journal or just for sticking on something to give it a little bit of pizzazz. Uh, next, one more stamp, I think. And this stamp set, I really did like. I thought it was really cute, the little uh, flowers on the letters. So that, or not the letters, on the numbers. So that would be really cute, again, in your journal. Or I don't, whatever. I mean, it doesn't have to be a journal. This is, I'm not even sure what this is. Oh, these are just uh, papers, like a uh, postcard size. And then... Inside, all the papers are black and white with some flowers on them, which are kind of cool. Uh, again, good for tearing and making a collage, that kind of thing. And even this outer outer one would be really nice for that. All right. Next, I got some of these tickets. And they give you quite a few of them. Let's see. I got a red set purple set, this cool brown set, and there's one more, one more, and then a uh, kind of golden yellow set. Got all of those. Now we're on to washi. <laughs> I got a lot of washi. The washi on there is cheap. I haven't used it yet to see how good of washi it is. A lot of times it's really, really thin washi, so it's not good for holding things together, but it's good for decoration. And this one I got just because it's all about travel. This set is so pretty. I want to say this was like two bucks for all of this with the shipping and everything, but it is such a pretty lavendery purple. Love it. And then I got this one. I don't know if you can see it, but those are big birds on there. I think it shows it now. I'd have to open them all up. Which is, I got a lot of washi, so I'm not going to do that, but there's a lot in there for the prices that you pay for it. This one I thought was really pretty with the, it looks very um, Asian with the florals. So pretty. Next are a couple uh, that I got the same one of, and it's just it's just words, which is really cool. This one, uh, again, is a kind of a traveling one, I guess. It says British Invasion, which is cute. But it looks kind of, you know, browns and colors would be nice for a travel journal. And then I got this one, which is, again, travel and kind of looks a little bit vintage here with the tickets and all of that but the main reason I got it was for this world one I really liked that one and um I like the lettering too those are really fun ones now then I got three of these and I'm not sure what's in it so let me open them and we will see all right I have opened them up and it is vellum pieces that have been printed on in their tickets. This one has different types of tickets for the cinema, for a party, special event. Uh, this is his ticket. Free. So those are cute. I've seen some ladies on um, Instagram who do quite a bit of collaging in their journaling and they had used these so I thought these would be fun to try and they actually tear these and use them um just these are all postage looks like of some sort Canada um, oops. big one from Portugal 
place on my bucket list. Another Canada one. So those are all postage. And then the last one is here we go. Try that again. And the last one is another different kind of postage one. Just has different timestamps. Almost looks like um, that you can write on them like they're postcards with postage on them. But very cool. So that's my little mini haul there. Thank you all for watching. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time.